Hey, what's going on guys? It's APR2K Productions here, and today I'm going to be showing you two ways to corrupt any Minecraft world. Now, they have varying effects depending on what you do. The first one, you're just going to want to create a brand new world. Obviously in creative, because you're going to use a command to do this. And the command is extremely simple, and it's the same for both of them, with a slight alteration, which I'll show you in a second. So, all we're going to want to do is TP to 0, 75, like, million or something, and then 0. And then, that you get that, and it teleports you to your server list for some reason. But, I can try to go back into this world as much as I want, and it's completely destroyed. A restart of your game will not fix this. Now, the second method, which is worse... Again, just create a brand new world just like that. You're going to do the exact same thing, except you're going to put more zeros. And this one is far worse, because what this one will do is it will completely freeze your game. And uh, I'll show you what happens when you try to go back in after a restart. The reason that makes this one so bad is I keep pressing Alt F4. And it's doing absolutely nothing. This one freezes for multiple minutes before your game will eventually restart. Alright guys, so as you can see, the second method is definitely much worse because it not only freezes your game, but it also completely corrupts your world. Now, there is some varying level of uh, working in that because this is the first world that I corrupted using the second method. And as you can see, it's playable now. Basically, it just froze the game once and completely crashed it. But now the world is playable with no long-term lasting effects. However, the other world that I did, which is this one, this world is a little bit different. This one, I can go into, but it will get stuck on joining world and will never actually load. So yeah, that's pretty bad. So... I'd recommend you use the first method for guaranteed success, although the second method definitely can be a lot deadlier if you use it the right way. Um, I'm not sure the effectiveness of this on servers, I haven't really tried it, but it does work on Minecraft 1.15.1, as you guys could see. That's the version that my game is currently running. Hey guys, it's APR2K Productions here. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know it's not my typical type of content that I like to make here on this channel, however I did find it very interesting. I didn't learn this from other sources of any kind, such as YouTube channels or online. I figured this out completely on my own, and I thought it would be interesting to share with you guys. I've never seen a video like this on YouTube before, so I thought you guys would find it really interesting. Use with caution, but have a little fun with it. I hope you guys enjoyed, and peace out.